Hello everyone, welcome back to the Kentucky Central and Eastern Motor Railroad. January layout update. Happy New Year to all my subscribers and to everyone in the Motor Railroad hobby. Since the last update, I left off and mentioned that I was going to be having the cataract surgery done in November and unfortunately that surgery was not successful. Basically what I have found out since then and that the doctor that was going to, was going to do the, uh, the procedure found that I have a dislocated limb in my right eye. Now what that means is that just, you're leaning your eye just like a trampoline. Once a spring that holds it all together, well unfortunately 50% of those springs are missing and my lean in my right eye is basically just floating around. Uh, found out that if the laser had proceeded onward and thank goodness that the eyeball was not cooperating, uh, if the laser did actually happen, I would have been blind in the right eye. So thank goodness with a little favor that that did not happen. Uh, the doctor since then had referred me to a specialist in Cincinnati, Ohio and went up there on December the 30th. Uh, the doctor did a complete examination, looked at the situation and is able to help me. So basically on uh, here in a couple of days on February the 2nd, I would be going up there for surgery on the right eye and to have that procedure done. The doctor does sound very confident that I will have improvement in my right eye and he will be able to reposition the lean in my eye fairly close to center, get it reattached, remove my cataract and to put a implant in. And then after that then I go back to Cincinnati on March 21st for the left eye and have that done as well. <clears throat> uh, unfortunately I don't know if it, there is a dislocated limb in the left eye or not so we'll find out on that day. Because of that, um, not much has been going on in the layout area um, due to that all the necessary fun that is going toward uh, <coughs> the surgery in Cincinnati. Uh, where I'm at, I'm about three hours away from Cincinnati and we'll have to stay overnight in Cincy and due to the next day I have a doctor appointment very early in the morning before I come home. So temporarily the Kentucky Central and Eastern uh, is basically at a sand sale at this point and that's why there has not been much video or much update uh, just on the Facebook page. We'd like to take this opportunity and like to welcome all of the new subscribers that have subscribed to me since the last update in November. I'd like to welcome you and thank you for subscribing to me and look forward to many videos that you folks will be posting just on your channel. The plan I have for 2016, uh, once I get the eye surgery out of the way, and is to get back out here into the building and start getting down to doing the actual scenery. Uh, doing the actual scenery. Uh, the plan is over by the sand plant, the beverage company, that corner uh, will start there. And there will be a great crossing that will be somewhere beyond the beverage company that, that will go in from that point to the corner. All that will be scenery. As I start getting those items, the scenery, um, I will show them and everything on what I will be using. Um, I may do a how-to, but again, all the, the knowledge that I have I accumulated with scenery are things that I had learned just through watching YouTube, watching different videos, um, especially uh, with Thomas with the Nashville and Eastern Dirt Glass and as well as the, um, the Colorado um, the joint line. Uh, those three gentlemen had done excellent scenery work, great technique, and if you haven't seen them, just check them out. The other thing I have planned for this year, uh, right now I am working on a unit co-train. Uh, my co-train is not set for one particular railroad. 
uh, mainly steps for leasing company like FUR at, GEF at, and TIL at. The reason for that is because because what I do with the Kentucky Railroad Museum being a con great passenger conductor and being a rail traffic manager, um, these are the same equipment that I work with. Uh, we bring them in, store them, and they head back out. As <clears throat> here soon, I will be posting uh, on the group page of a file we showing what I'm looking for. Uh, if any of you see these equipment, uh, please let me know. Uh, I found it at eBay. It's looking like it's a pretty good resource. I have found some cars on eBay, but because I have no money right now, I just don't have to let them go and then find them at a later date. So be watching out for that. Uh, most of the cars that I have found are bathtub don, aluminum hopper, and they are made by Atlas, uh, the train man, the Sidley, uh, is Sidley, and from 2009, 2008, and so forth run. But uh, you know, once I post that file on the group page, you'll see what I'm talking about exactly. So if you see those, hey, please let me know. Uh, at this point, I'd just like to thank you, all of my subscribers that have been with me since I had started this layout a year ago. I know that I also promised that I was going to have a one year anniversary video, uh, a slideshow showing the progress of the layout. Unfortunately, I had a little bit of computer problem and that was not possible. But most of the pictures that I have are on the group page uh, with the Kentucky Central and Eastern. So if you're not a member, feel free to hop aboard to that group page and you'll see all the pictures and uh, the progress and stuff the layout. I am planning on doing some review this year. Um, actually, once I finish this video, there will be a review on the Atlas bathtub down on hopper, the FURS series, and I figured I'd take a just give it a try and um, just see what happened here. Um, I have a local motor that's not working right. It's meant to have to be remotored, which will happen at some point down the road, and we'll see how that goes. But um, just again, uh, I thank you all of. You've, all of my subscribers for being with me, hanging out there, uh, playing with me and whatnot. Uh, it's, I told you just a couple of days away, so I can get a little nervous and hope and pray that I'll have some real good results and if things really does pan out, um, it's going to help me out tremendously and I'll be really tickled to death. So, again, Happy New Year. Welcome to board all the new subscribers that had subscribed to my channel since November. And look forward to seeing you guys here in the future. Have any questions, comments, suggestions, please leave them below in the comment box. If you're not a member of the group page on Facebook, the Kentucky Central and Ethan, please hop aboard and check it out. And I do post uh, information, updates, and whatnot on how I'm doing and what's going on just on the layout. Again, I thank you, be safe, and have fun model railroading.